Okay, for this hair, I'm going to, again, use uh, a few dates hair that's been set uh, prior to filming, about maybe to a day or two. I'm going to brush it out, and then I'm going to start off by parting a, a, a side part. And then I'm going to section off the entire front section of my hair into three different sections. And then I just section off the back so it doesn't get in the way. And then what you're going to want to do is tease the both uh, two sides first. And of course, <laughs> you're going to want to smooth all that craziness out. And I'm going to take some of my Suavecita pomade to help out with that. And with all my other uh, victory rolls, I use two fingers to curl. And then you're just wanna, you're going to want to curl in and then pin. And if there's any sagging in the back, you'd want to pin that up too. And then repeat those steps on the other side. Now for the middle section, you're going to section that off into three sections. The first section I work on, I'm going to tease and then smooth. And to help smooth it out, I'm going to use uh, some of my Suavecito Grooming Spray. And then you're going to start to roll under. Almost like if you were creating um, a barrel roll or uh, like you would if you were trying to create bumper bangs. It's just a smaller section of, of what a bumper bang would look like. And then go ahead and pin. Now for this section, I'm not going to tease because I kind of want it to lay flat onto my head. I'm just going to take some pomade to help smooth it out. And then you're going to roll under and then lay it flat like a nice pin curl. And you want it to kind of uh, stay a little lower on your forehead, not so high up. Or just a little lower than that first curl you did. Now for that back section, I'm going to tease it and you kind of want that height back there. And once you're done teasing, you're going to want to smooth it out. And again, you want that height there so don't push it down too much when you're bringing it forward. And then you're going to roll under and create another pin curl similar to the one that you just did. And then kind of spread out that top section. Now for the back, I didn't film it because I've shown you guys how to do that before, so I'll link the video below. But that's pretty much it to this hairstyle. I hope you guys liked it. You can follow me on Instagram and Facebook as well. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!